And now, your first alert five weather. Well, welcome back. A gorgeous morning here in Southern Colorado. This photo sent in earlier today by Bruce in Garden of the Gods. And I mean, two gorgeous places, right? Looking at Pikes, that snow capped view and Garden of the Gods itself. Not too bad itself, wouldn't you agree? And it's going to continue to be a very nice day for us to get outside no matter where you're going. Maybe you're heading out skiing today. Winter Park enjoying its second weekend. You see the people lined up on the slopes to get their first runs of the day in and no matter where you go, high pressure is in place. So temperatures, they're going to continue to warm up today as they did yesterday for much of the first half of next week. Our next pattern change doesn't happen until the end of next week into next weekend. Now, if you are about to step outside ahead of the various Veterans Day activities going on, you're going to want to bring the jacket with you. Probably don't need me to tell you that, but it's not that surprising. It is November after all temperatures right now. 40 in the Springs. Good morning, Pueblo. You're at 33, 28 in Woodland Park, 46 Canyon City, upper 20s to lower 30s for us along the eastern plains. Now we do still have a little bit of energy and moisture in the upper atmosphere for us right now. This trough coming down from the north that's starting to work out of the state now and some moisture as well, which you can see in the form of some cloud cover that's also working out of the state. So as we move through the rest of the morning, the cloud cover in the northern part of Colorado, if you are driving that direction, will dissipate, leaving the entire state with sunny skies. And as we take a look at future cast, as we head through the rest of the day, temperatures warm up to about seasonable normals in the mid 50s in the springs, low 60s in Pueblo. After sunset, we cool down very quickly once again tonight, but temperatures will be a little bit warmer than they were last night and we rinse and repeat tomorrow. Temperatures once again rising to the middle to upper 50s in the springs, mid 60s in Pueblo. The only difference tomorrow evening, we may see a few clouds work through after sunset, mainly in Woodland Park Monument in the springs with some upper level moisture and it'll just cloud your view of the stars for a couple of hours. Now, if you do want to get out and do anything this weekend, maybe go fishing, sunshine every single day today, tomorrow and Monday. Temperatures generally warming up. Of course, it'll be a bit cooler if you're heading to a higher elevation if you want to head south or east, temperatures will be a little bit warmer because we will be at a lower elevation. So we'll see mid 60s to upper 60s for our temperatures by Monday. This is all due to this big dome of high pressure making its way into the area. That's been in process of making its way towards us the last couple days and that continues for us into Monday, Tuesday and Wednesday. But as we head towards the end of the week, that's when we start to see a pattern change. Here's our jet stream right now off to our north, bringing in those warm temperatures. Friday, though, you see this big dome of cold air that's going to start to work towards us next weekend and in, with an additional lobe of energy moving south. And that will give us potentially our next weather maker. At the very least, it'll cool us down. Might give us a little bit of snow as well, but I don't want to get too far ahead of myself. Just stay tuned to future forecasts as we get a little bit closer to that event. As we take a look at your super seven day forecast, sun, sun and more sun heading your way. Monday in particular, it's going to be sunny in the morning, sunny in the afternoon for lunch, sunny in the early evening as the sun starts to set temperatures about five to seven degrees above normal, topping out around 60 degrees. So a great day to get outside, maybe have an outdoor lunch that day. We'll bring in some more cloud cover by the middle of the week, but we'll stay mainly dry temperatures topping out at 66 Wednesday before we start to head back towards seasonable averages to end the week in Pueblo. We go from 62 today to 70 Tuesday and 71 on Wednesday. It might be a little bit breezy on Thursday as some energy works through, but that's really the only big thing you'll notice in the next seven days. And then again, we'll turn more seasonable by Friday in Canyon City. Temperatures warming up into the upper 60s by Tuesday and 70. The warm spot on Wednesday and again, also breezy Thursday, maybe breezy Friday as well as temperatures start to trend back towards average ahead of our next weather maker. And in Woodland Park, your warm spot Tuesday and Wednesday, 59 more sun than clouds. And then we'll see breezy conditions Thursday in that same system gives us a bit more wind on Friday. So just, you know, maybe have the hat with the chin strap on Friday. <laughs> All right.